Hey guys, we've got a beautiful family in front of us. we got Michael, Sarah and Sophia. And um, you two guys have done multiple cleanses. Uh, I'd just like to ask you if you could give a testimonial about what you thought, honestly and from your heart, when you did these transformations. Michael, could I start with you? You can. You can see a slight transformation, 15-odd uh, kilos after three cleanses. Um, I've tried every diet under the sun. Atkins, I've done the five and two. I'm basically your typical yo-yo dieter. Um, I love my beer, I love my burgers. Um, but I also love how I feel now. Um, so I think I've added a couple of years to my life. That, that's the main reason of doing it. So gotta be honest, the first cleanse that I did, um, after four days, I was really questioning it. <clears throat> Massive headaches, detoxing. Um, but then day five hit me and, and it, I don't know what hit me and, and just energy started to hit me. And um, it was from that, <clears throat> excuse me, from that is then I was looking for the quick fix and um, Sarah kept saying, it's not a quick fix, this is a you know, life change. And I go, oh yeah, whatever, yeah, cool, cool. I'm in for a life change as well, but just give me that quick fix. Day five kicked in and I started running, and I haven't run for years, and, and I love running, and I just found all this energy. At the end of the 10 days, the first, the first transformation was six and a half kilos of lost, and I did it for weight loss, it was purely that. I, as I said, I was 110 kilos. Um, Sarah, however, did it. Um, she was into it, and she was doing it more for the health benefits of it. Mm. I wanted to feel clean, I wanted to feel good, I wanted that buzz that everyone was talking about, the energy, I love my fitness, I'm at the gym five days a week um, and and I pretty much got the buzz at about day three um, and, and I was about two days ahead of Michael so he was, I was really annoying him going, this is amazing, <laughs> you're going to feel amazing and he's like feeling like death yes. basically. <laughs> um, but yeah, when it kicked in you were just buzzing, weren't you? The biggest thing was then to sustain it, um, not to put it back on. And then we had another go just before Christmas, we were on our holidays, we haven't stopped our life. You know, it's not like we're just on a permanent diet. Um, holidays, we did the second cleanse. Again, great results, didn't expect another six kilos to come off. Um, a couple of months later, we're then into the third one. You know, by Christmas, I hope to be 90 kilos. I mean, that, that's my, I can't remember the wow. last time I've been 90 kilos. and. Uh, I've dropped literally inches off my belts, um, that I've had to cut the belts, um, and, and by Christmas, so I'm, I'm not hoping to do it in massive chunks like that, so I'm now 93 and a half, hopefully by Christmas 90, and, and that's that's the, probably the ideal weight that I want, and this is something I can see I can sustain and convert or not, I'd now make healthier choices uh, when I eat out and things like that, um, basically you do start swapping the, the flavours that you now explore. Mm -hmm. I mean, celery and hummus. I mean, I, I couldn't really sell anyone celery and hummus, but I now eat celery and hummus with Marmite and look forward to it. it it's just, it, it opens up a whole new world of flavour and so forth. Yeah. So. And you couldn't, taste couldn't the flavours. Yeah. Your taste buds are now so acute, aren't they? And, um, but we use a mixture of products. It's, you know, you come off the cleanse. It's not a case of now I'm just going to use one we use Kamut. We're a big, big, we love waking up having our shot of Kamut in the morning. That feels great. You, you use the love and I you love mix it with week. cacao powder. And um, we use almond milk now. We don't have dairy. Um, we've stayed clear of dairy. Because I used to get really bad sinus issues. To, you know, now I'm not having dairy. The sinus issues have disappeared. My eczema has cleared up. Um, you love the the mint, don't you? The the uh, the power shake with the mint. That's really good. So um, it, it's just a case of incorporating it into everyday um, eating. And also we use um, Jamie Oliver's superfood, superfood yeah. book because it's clean eating as well. And just it, life is good. I mean, so, we do. You know, we have naughty stuff as well. But you have the naughty stuff. Humans. But you, still you know, love beer, yeah, yeah. I love the beer. Yeah. I love my gin. And you just, but you have it. But you just. You, you don't get affected by it um, as much and to be fair you can't wait to then have that mm -hmm. shot of Kamut mm -hmm. you know the next morning and get back into that yes feeling. So would you say um, what it's done is kick-started you into a new whole different healthy lifestyle? Very much. Yeah and is, would you say while you're using these whole food products they are whole food products would you say this is something that you would just nat naturally and happily just as normal carry on yeah. for the rest of your life, rest of your life. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it, yes. yeah it's a given this is this is how we live our you know live our lives now is, is using these products and incorporating them into organic natural whole foods as well so <laughs> they complement each other and 
and it's just all really good, mm. really good. And Fantastic. can't wait for the kids' stuff to come out. <laughs> kids' stuff is coming out. So, hey, listen, guys, thanks very much for testimonial. Thank you. Uh, we're going to go inside now and listen to. Yep. Troy Casey, the certified health nut, and um, and have a fantastic time. So thanks very much, guys. Cheers. Cheers. Thank you.